Morning everybody, Tuesday 12th of June. Uh, today is the day that the Ricky Dozang Haku, I hope you've seen the video from last week by now, we're going to start going into the concrete ponds inside. Feeling more just sorting the net behind me at the moment. And as usual, once we get some fish in the bowl, I will have a closer look at them. Selection of the Ricky Dozang fry has been finished at the mud pond for today. In this bowl, the ones that have come into the concrete pond. Bill just sorting through, picking a few out. But we'll look at more closely in a moment. Right, here we have a rather attractive net of Ricky Dozan babies, born on the 22nd of April. So it makes them, I guess, like seven weeks old or something, six weeks old, seven weeks old. Many you could have picked out as having particularly interesting characteristics, like some qualities. These are some that Bill just quickly picked through as he sorted through the hundreds that have come in to the net today, to the pond today. One thing that the Ricky Dozan babies, several of them that were kept last year, had in common but very interesting patterns. Uh, some great patterns here. Also some very traditional patterns as well. This Maritan here, one the bill was particularly fond of. Large three step here. Good. And Maureen just counting the rest of them into the net when they'll stay like the other fish were coming for a few weeks before going out to the pond. The net now contains just five. I've quickly gone through and picked out five that for those that were in the net kind of stood out a little bit to me. And I see five we have now in the net. A total of 787 have come in, and this is the last one we're going to the pond. It's just one that I picked out. I think this is really, really appealing, and one that I'm going to put my name against. A really pretty pattern. Love the way it crosses across the dorsal area there, and it works all the way back. And just under its dorsal rim on the other side, there's another wire patch with some red there as well. So, and now it's a really pretty little fish, and hopefully, pretty confident. One which we will be able to follow for some time to come here at Purding Quite Farm. Pretty sure it's one that'll make it out of the grind ponds. That's the definite, and hopefully, hopefully, for some time beyond that as well.